Hey boys and girls, welcome back to another exciting project where we will be exploring lines of all kinds. Before we talk about our next project, which I'm sure you're going to love, let's check out some of the lines that are in the world. They're straight, zigzag, wavy, thin, thick, the list goes on. Our newest project is entitled Pet Portraits. We will be using a variety of lines to create texture and movement in our pet's fur. If you haven't had a chance, check out my pet tutorials posted yesterday to help you draw your own pet. Don't have a pet? Don't worry, create your own. Now let's get ready to make some art. Now I'm going to show you how to create texture by using a variety of lines in my pet's portrait. Follow along. First, I start off with a basic sketch. Then I use short lines, wider lines, thin lines to create lots of texture in the fur. I even added texture in my background to create even more interest. Don't forget to add some color too. Here is one more example of where I take a basic drawing and add lots of lines and even change the directions of the lines to create even more interest in movement. And again, add some color to give it that extra pop. Now it's your turn and I can't wait to see what you come up with. Don't forget to share your artwork at Miss O Art Studio.